Hello weirdos and welcome back and today we're gonna remodel the White House. Yeah, let's uh let's start remodeling the White House. Alright. So we need a barrier. And yes, I'm playing on my Xbox. Leave me alone. It's gonna take fifty years, but who cares? So we were modeling the White House. And um, we're going to add a new addition to the top. We're just going to add like a little area, maybe a hangout room or whatever. Who knows? <clears throat> Excuse me. I was just joking earlier. Yeah, surprise, surprise. All right. There's one thing I want to show you guys, though. Um, I do not want to press it. Okay, good. Okay. Now, if we go over here. We added a new floor underneath. So, if we go down. So, anything underground, there's always going to be bedrock. So, it's not like they can dig dig in and all that. So, it's kind of nice. So, we have a little restaurant here. Snack machine and all that. This is the presidential um, bunker, I guess you could say. I uh, did not mean to do that. Alright. So, what we did was we did something kind of cool. We added more, sh we added shops. Okay, so we have the kitchen. This is where the kitchen is for the entire White House. And we're going to be remodeling the inside too. So, that's what we're going to be doing today. We're going to be doing, we're going to be remodeling the inside of the White House, making it look more presentable nicer more convenient so this is new, this is the new addition so we can add like a dentist doctor whatever okay they even have more offices over here just because they can because there's there's a lot of white house there's a lot of offices in the white house so <coughs> I, I was thinking about it but um i honestly didn't so what I was showing you is that in another video, we will be basically, um, so the entire White House is barrier blocks, literally barrier blocks everywhere. So next we're going to have to cut off all of this and, uh, basically make a whole another floor that will be in another video. So. Yes, we're going to have fun with that. Alright, so let's go back in. Alrighty. See, you can still see where everything is. There's no barriers inside the White House. Actually, yes, there is. There's um, these guys. It's the White House staff. So we're going to have, we're going to be moving a lot of this. So, first and foremost, we're going to close off the West Wing. So the press can still come in, but the press won't be able to see what's going on, you know? Don't want that press um, wanting to uh, search us, you know? Confidentiality. They'll see it afterwards, but just for their protection. Alright, and then we're going to close off this entrance. Alrighty. So now I can get in. There we go. <coughs> and then the Piak. The Piak. You can get in here. There's multiple ways to get in here. There's two ways. So we'll just close off this one. Not really a big deal. So, alright. First things first, we're going to. So the square office is fine. So we're going to just take this out. All right. Cool. Awesome. And then, yeah, the square office is going to be under renovation for a while. So he'll be using the, the bunker one for now until we can get her <clears throat> get him back in here because like 
this is not really original, I guess you can say. Um, so this one specifically has been blown up M maybe two times, three times. I don't, I don't know. So it's been blown up a couple times. Um, and yeah, currently I'm the current president. So also because I'm the president, I just work downstairs. Um, if I really need to, but honestly, no one's on this right now, so I don't have to worry about it. Actually, right now, let's, um, and the gates are fine. So we opened up the gates. So, alright. Clear room. And let's also shut down this entrance. <clears throat> And then we are going to cut this. We're going to cut this out. Honestly, this is our own design um, because it's a, a whole our country based off the United States. It's still um, we make it. Does that make sense? It. We still add some of our own touches. We don't copy exactly like the capital. The capital's different than what the actual one is. So, yeah, it's not really a big deal, but, eh, it is what it is. Alright. Cool. And then, one, we're moving this room. The Camo Beast room. This is what it's named. This is after me. So... Yeah. Good thing, uh. Yeah. Well, this was from, from my last election, I think. I think we named it my last election. Yeah. Alright. Yeah, Camel Beast Room. We'll probably move it, like, over there or something. So. Alright. Let's get some. Some spruce wood. Awesome. And, uh, right now we're just going to focus on the Oval Office today. Or should I say the Square Office, because it's Minecraft. It's honestly the reason why we did that, because it's, yeah. So we were wanting this more open. So basically you walk in perfectly. We don't want it to be blocked by this, because it's just a pain in the butt. Like, we want the entrances to be accessible but we don't want them to be um restricted either oh it's oak i keep forgetting it's oak wood because i use commands all right just cover it there for now all right cool this is looking good so let's make it there It's still a square office, but it's not like it was. So there. Yes. Cool. I'm liking that. I'm liking that a lot. So let's put up this. That, that. And... It's still going to be a square office. 100% it's still gonna be a square office uh, let's put that over here yeah we're just trying to uh, place things correctly you know what I mean so yes yeah, so this is gonna be one presidential area this is presidential entrances so cool and it gives it a little bit more room and there's a space specifically designed for the bookshelf. Beautiful. Alright. And then we go down on this. Okay. Alright. And then let's look how it looks outside. I think we can lose lose these pillars just a little bit. Cool. Alright. 
that's actually more that's actually a little better because now his assistant is not entirely in the front it just goes right here when the president goes in and out cool i like that all right next of course we're just gonna add this and then we can get rid of this big thing i'm not really liking that cool awesome and then we can honestly get rid of this there we go so basically it just looks like it just came out just a little bit no one really noticed it's not that noticeable so oh well and then let's put in the bookcases awesome and then we're going to do something special with this one so we're going to um, maybe we can um, maybe we'll put in some nether brick nether brick would look good that's cool nice and then we'll add a fireplace because I know the White House has fireplaces. I don't know if they use them or not. I don't know. So. Cool. Now we have a fireplace going. Um, and yeah. So. I still like it. And I don't like how it's. I'm going to. We're going to move this wall. One. Just one. So, honestly, I like the books itself, so we're going to keep the books, so it just looks natural. So it looks like we put the books there, but it's actually on the other side, instead of this side. Does that make sense? Kind of? Maybe? Then, yeah, we'll just get rid of that. Cause there are some weird windows in the White House. So we can get rid of that. Put that in. Cool. And then I like it all books. Let's do all books. Even this one. Yeah. Cool. Looking nice, looking nice. Alright, and then let's put the door right here. Yes. That looks nice. So basically you walk through. Hello, Mr. President. Alright, now let's get some glows down. Let's fix the ceilings. Make sure it all matches. So, alright. Because it's not that old, the White House, um, even though it was like one of the first buildings that we built after the attack, um, it, it, it's never been, because the White House has had renovations, the Oval Office has had many renovations, in fact, so um, I think it would just look better if we did something good I guess so all right going good good and good all right let's get the dark oak awesome okay I want it to be in the center of the room okay so door to door if that makes sense all right awesome now, if we can do that, that would look cool. Mm -hmm. Nah, we'll just keep it like that. Cool. Alright, and then we'll also put in a um, presidential um, emergency button, I guess. We can do that. Alright, I think this one will actually be... Actually, it's not centered in the room at all. 
It looked like it, according to the bookshelf. But with this window, that's when you know. I want to be a right. What the pro? I like it, so. <coughs> it's it's looking nice. It's looking nice. Small desk, but we'll fix that. Right. I want to say the president's desk is pretty big. And let's delete that. There we go. Now we have the president's desk. Ah, it looks nice. But now it's like... It looks smaller. Why does it look smaller? I think the, I think it was just a little bit back. It was just a little bit back. I think it was at... Yes, it was like this. I remember this. Alright. Alright, and then... Because I remember we had couches. I'm like, it couldn't have shrunk. We extended it by a little bit. Or it's the same size. I think it's the same size. There. Yes, that looks better. So when people come in... Um, there will be chairs. So let's do some chairs. So there's the couch. Okay. And I think we should do it. Just mini couches. There we go. Like that. Okay, the base fits the door. Okay. I like that. And now let's add like a table in the middle. I think we did before. Nothing fancy. Alright, now we have it. We have no, it's at a clock. So the president knows the time. Why am I referring to myself in the third person? I don't know. Right. Cool. There we go. The presidential office. I like it. It's pretty nice. Nice. Alright, so there's the president. There's the Oval Office. Uh, the remodeling. And, um, yeah. We'll, uh... I'll show you guys eventually once we're done with the entire renovation, but honestly, it's looking good. It's looking good. Anyway, guys, see you guys in the video. Peace out.